What's up, your boy South Shell Rise, aka a Penny Pincher, with some old rank match videos. Let me turn off the display settings right quick before I get into this video. I had to do it. I'm counting on you for backup. As you can tell, this video is not live. These replays have happened already in the past, well, just a day ago. Fight. In my last three videos, I didn't have commentary on them, but I wanted to get them up, man. It's the only way I can get something up. Sometimes. I didn't want to do commentary. I couldn't do commentary because, for one, I was, uh, parenting. And for two, I can't play as good when I'm talking and playing at the same time. So I definitely didn't want to live commentate on rank mode. Now, this name has not been used in a long time. And my rank is lower than it was. This is the first name I got to Warrior 2. And then I just tumbled. And then it was somehow, back in the day, I figured out what was happening. I was getting all kind of lag and the game was running real bad. But somehow I had my router set up wrong to where guests could access my internet. And I stay in an apartment complex. And God knows how many people was booching off of my internet, slowing me down. And I feel like I haven't been showing what I really should be showing on this page. I've been kind of taking it easy on player match mode, just BSing. But y'all want to see some hardcore competition. So I'm like, let me get on rank mode again. Brush off the cobwebs, as y'all can tell in the earlier videos, in rank the last you know, videos I put up, I started off rested because I haven't been playing a lot lately. But what better way to knock the rest off than to hop in the rank mode where people really fighting for something? And it didn't start off too promising. The very, the very first match I got on rank mode was a lag fist, and I almost quit. I almost said, "Forget it. This is why I stick to play a match." But I. I stuck it out and I got some good matches to bring y'all. And I plan to keep playing ranked. This is the name I'll use for rank mode. I want to keep this name private. I never planned to show it, but things happen and it got shown. And I say it once again. I have to say it every time, just in case you missed the video where I said this before about this name. I don't accept friend requests on this name. This was meant to be a private name to where I didn't have to. You know how like uh when them celebrities go out with shades on and caps and hitting, they just want to be regular. This was intended to be my just want to be regular name. I just want to be a regular dude and play Tekken. But it got exposed. So now this is just gonna be my rank mode name. No, oh, and if you're wondering about these costumes, the last time I played on this name was about. Christmas time. <laughs> As you can tell by my color coordination, this was a Christmas outfit, I guess. So I got matched up with this Raven player, and I could swear he learned a few moves from me, because his fighting style seemed a little similar. Or maybe not. Maybe there's only so many ways you can play Raven. He's going for the ride either way. Ah. Watch them toes. And he sent me a little hate mail after this match. He called me a leg spamming bitch. Or something like that. And wouldn't you know right after that, we got matched again. This is one reason why I never really sent hate mail. And... There's been a lot of times where I want to send something like, yeah, bitch, cheesy ass, I beat you. Now what? You know, you want to talk a little trash. See, look. See how he did a little hot move? He was he was excited because he started off good and he had sent me some hate mail. Not thinking we would get matched up again. But that's why I never do stuff like that. I never talk trash on messages. Win or lose. Because nine times out of ten, you're going match, to get matched up with that person again. 
and we might get lucky and beat him the first time. But when they whoop your ass that second time, you're gonna get some taunting back. <laughs> then you'll get matched up a third time, and then they'll beat you again. It's like, oh god, they won two out of three. So, I learned to keep my mouth shut. But it's a lot of times where I want to send some hate mail. Not, no, not hate mail. Um, if I win a close match with somebody who I think is cheesy, I want to send some trash mail. Like, get that mess out of here. But I hold back. Y'all notice, I've been mean, in a lot of Ling Yu fights. She is rampant in rank mode. Well, mainly because I get matched up with a lot of the same dudes. I set my connection to five bars only, and I guess I get matched up with the same few guys in my area. And that Ling guy was damn good. He beat me like two or three times, and I finally got a win off of him on, on the last fight that I put up. Barely. And he also beat me. I went back and watched, and I noticed he it was one match in that we had Paul and Law where he beat me. So I don't like that. If I run across him again, I'll be prepared. But it's got me thinking, like, maybe I should drop Horong, which I plan to do anyway. Because I'm not really feeling him. I'm sorry. I'm not feeling this style. Maybe I'll drop Horong and pick up Ling. Zhao Yu. Can you imagine the damage I could do with a tricky character like Ling Zhao I need a lady in my repertoire. I need a lady on the squad. I love the ladies in real life, not fighting against them. Because they can be tough. But I think I need some feminine fighters. This guy, I, I fought him one time in uh, one of the previous videos. He is a walker, or she? I don't know if it's a man or a woman. I'm counting on you for backup. Not a team I'm too excited to face. I mean, Lily and Anna. I'm not as afraid of Lily as I used to be back in Tekken Five days, when everybody cheesed with her. But Anna is a character that always gives me the blues, man. Hop kick and I'm gone. Go ahead on and break the floor. Get that out the way. I wanted that out the way. I didn't need to interrupt none of my combos. Now we're down in the pits and I'm about to go more to combat style. Only one of us making out of here alive. Who y'all got y'all money on? Don't think just because I'm putting these videos up that I'm gonna win. I'm trying to keep them all in order. If you look at my one loss record, you can keep up with uh, how the matches are going. It's proof that I'm not skipping around. You might see me skip ahead a few fights if I'm not recording at the time. But for the most part, I'm going back to back. She just turned her back to me and didn't even attack. She just just wanted just wanted to disrespect me, you know. Ah. Ooh. Okay. And the steel toe boots hurt a little bit. Go for the toes, Raven. Watch them. Watch them toes. You know I'm going to do it. I can predict my own style. That's true too. Like if I'm going back and recording the video, I don't even have to remember what's happening in the match. I can look at what's happening on screen and say, do this. Like I can predict what I am what I would do next. I'd be expecting to be wrong, but I'm like, oh, I actually did do that. <laughs> It's like I'm watching somebody's play and thinking about what I would do in that situation. Beautiful little mix-up right there from Raven. Mm. Yeah, I can rewind that if you need to. Any Raven players out there? Eh, 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 eh. Eat the cave. Ooh. 
Oh, oh, can I get the perfect? Can I get that? Yes, I can do that. You are not good enough. Come on, man, you was up by two rounds. You gonna let me come back? What's gonna happen? Is he gonna let me come back? Is he gonna choke? I've been there before, man. I hate when I do that two up, three down. That's the most salty way to lose imaginable. I'm trying to be careful here. He got rage. Push back. Oh, missed him. Left the toes open. Spinning head, but nope. I was wrong that time. Predicting what I would do. There it is. Come on. We dancing. We dancing. Oh, I had an opening right there. Still watch them toes, watch them toes. Left him open. Oh, and he got it. He got it. He left it open and I took that fight. It's not over till it's over, baby. I'm pinching pennies. I'm not trying to put more quarters into this arcade machine. I want to play all day on 50 cents. Up yours. Round one. Here we go. Hmm. Okay. Ah. Oh no, it's Miguel. Damn, stomp me out like that. Oh, my head is busted. I gotta get out. Raven. Oh. Ah, yeah. This dude is blocking too much. I think I ran across him in a previous video too. I'm gonna be putting up these ranked matches for a while. I'm gonna keep it like this. Because I'm sure the matches are much more interesting. Eh, eh, eh. Oh, we got out! I thought I had him caught in the wall mix-up. Oh, watch them toes. Uh, uh, wall. I might be out for a little while, y'all, out of commission, so I'm trying to put up as many videos as I can because I got a cavity in my wisdom tooth, and it's looking like they want to remove it. If any of y'all had y'all wisdom teeth out as adults, like, not as soon as they came in. I'm like an adult, and I think it's supposed to be worse when you let them stay in for some years and then get them out. I don't know, man. I'm hoping that if I have to get them out, first of all, I'm hoping I don't die. Watch them toes, damn it! Because I just saw a story like a couple months ago where a dude died getting his wisdom teeth pulled. That's a terrible way to die. But if I survive, I'm hoping the pain is not that bad. I'm, I'm guessing I can take it. Now, right, see right there? I don't know what the fuck happened right there, man. I was mashing on Perry. And he would not parry that sweet. And once that happened, I was like, oh god, that ruined any chance I had. Look at that, now he just... I'm discombobulated because I couldn't believe that I didn't parry that on that wall. Go to hell, Miguel. Now what was I talking about with my teeth? Let's yes, look what have it, we got a match. Back to back. I was pissed off now. On my stage, Condor Canyon? Ooh, and why don't I ever remember to do a a bound and tag assault when I splat them on the wall. Eh, 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 eh. Oh. I probably could have did a regular combo on one net. Looking back on that. What was I talking about with my teeth? Uh, yeah, the pain. I, I, I guess I'd be okay because, you know, I done passed kidney stones, man. I done passed like five or six of them mugs. 
Not something to be proud of, it just happened to me. And that was true pain. Guess I got a man up. Here we go. Music breakdown. Oh, I love the music on this stage. When it syncs up with the fight. See, love when the music picked up right there. If I would have hit him with a super combo at that time, oh, that that string didn't finish. It would have been, I would have got hyped. Cause whenever I do something in time with the music on this stage, it do something to me. It's the perfect fight stage music. It's like it's, it's, it picks up, then it, it, it quiets down, then it pauses, then it comes back. Then right here, this is like a this part of the song is like when you. You're both on your defense, but everybody's attacking and you're just blocking, blocking, blocking. And who's gonna get a hit? That's not what's happening on the screen, but you know, that's what I picture. <laughs> Where you going, boy? You on the wall now? What you gonna do? Ah, I shouldn't have came down with that. Ah, oh, he blocked low. Cause at this point I noticed that he had a habit of blocking high, so I started going low a little more. Here we go. Ah, and that didn't come out right. That was supposed to be my launch kick. That killed my momentum. Ah, I couldn't get the wall bound. I'm in a good spot. And then he comes in with the sharp as hell toe boot hop kick. Didn't want that. Put myself in a terrible position. Uh, I didn't want that kick to come out during haze. I wanted the low kick. Can't lose this guy again. This is actually a, a frustrating team to fight. I was not expecting this fight to be, or these past couple fights to be so irritating against this guy. Ah, oh, shoulda. Well, I guess I didn't need to bound him. There we go with the bound. And I was like, oh shit, Leia's gonna be stuck in because it's not gonna reach. Now I gotta find a way to sneak lay back out, and I got it. Uh, uh, uh. Get some space. Oh, I should have kept that going. I didn't think it would knock him in the air. I thought I would mix him up and then throw a grab in. Okay. Oh, why not let it fly on that one? Ooh. When it pose. Yeah. 